I'm looking at Top Snipe. I don't see him up there. No, oh, she's down low. I'm gonna go check it out. There they are. Ooh, ah, ooh, sit down, son. The crazy Spartan. Welcome back, everybody. Gray Spartan here, doing a little bit of forging here again on Friday. Been kind of enjoying my forging. Um, going through the map glacier. Taking a look around. I had this idea the other night just for a map. Just kind of made it uh, pretty simple. And it, it, at the end of this video, it's not complete. But uh, it's definitely got a good start. Now, I think it came out okay so far. Of course, there's more stuff to do. You know, how if you ever forge it all, it, it, it's a process. It really is a process. Um, as you can see right here, I'm just trying to just get the base layout I kind of want a flat ground and Glacier just does not have flat ground um, but I did want some snow and especially for this time of year this time of season uh, I wanted some snow wanted that type of map and I just want to have some fun I, I really just want to get some guys on at some point and and just have a good time uh, playing and just having fun um, overall you know uh, just recently, as a matter of fact, I played some uh, Master Chief Collection and uh, played some Halo 2 Anniversary, and I had a lot of fun. It was really enjoyable. Um, I guess the best way to put it is it was it was almost refreshing uh, to play the Master Chief Collection in that uh, aspect. Um, and I say that because... It's been a while. It's been a long while since we've had a, more of a classic Halo. I mean, it really has been. Um, the classic Halo was pretty much Halo 3, and that was it. Uh, that's the last time we've had a classic type of Halo. So, play, well, you want to count the Master Chief Collection? I guess you can, but I personally would not. <laughs> uh, the Master Chief Collection is... It's the Master Chief Collection. That's all I can say. What could have been so great fell down so hard. <laughs> Which is so sad. Uh, but you never know, man. Like I said, they are planning an update uh, soon-ish. Um, I imagine more details will come out soon. Uh, at, least, at least what they're kind of looking at. But I, I can definitely understand them holding off on that a uh, little bit. Um, so yeah, yeah, there is that going on, and I really hope that they do take a look and update the playlist, and of course, update matchmaking so it's a little bit more consistent, um, all that type of stuff, and it'd be a lot more fun, a lot more enjoyable, because I love Halo 5, but man, I tell you what, getting back to the classics is just fun too. I've just kind of... I just kind of jumping around, man. To be honest, I'm just playing kind of a little bit of everything. I'm playing Reach every now and then, playing uh, MCC, jumping in on that. Um, what else am I doing? I'm just, uh, as I said, going around doing those. Uh, even throwing in the uh, 360 version of Halo 4 because I know, I know, I, I kind of like that Infinity stuff every now and then. Not, not to the point where it's just like so overwhelmingly crazy but just a little bit you know just to change it up but one thing I realized man I really it really came to light uh, when I did jump back into the Halo 4 um, it's just how much 30 FPS after, uh, is is a factor once you come from 60 FPS going up when I when it first really came out and we went from 30 to 60. I didn't particularly notice a difference. Uh, nothing crazy. I mean, you, you could tell everything was smoother. But, man, when you go backwards, that's when you can tell. Uh, I just, you, you can just feel it. You can go around and you can just look at it and just like, oh, wow. That just is so different. But... Anyways, I, I just uh, felt like doing some more forging, guys. And I wanted to make this little quick map. And... Um, the idea of this map is more of a 1v1 as I like small maps huge maps BTB is just not my thing I like small maps I like the close quarters um, 
it just feels more at home to me. Uh, I feel a lot better doing that. Uh, uh, BTB, I can jump into, but I do it so rarely. I, I don't do it a lot because it's just, um, I don't know, just too much chaos. Uh, I don't know. I do like the vehicle combat, but I don't like... I don't like Halo 5's and Halo 4's vehicles. I just don't. Um, uh, the reason is I don't like the Warthogs because... Uh, I may, I'm naming this map right now if you wanted to check it out. But it's not done. It, this What you see here is, is all that's done. Um, but um, I said I don't like the, the Halo 4 and Halo 5 vehicles. Uh, especially like the Warthogs. Because the Warthogs... They got that stupid and I that overheat uh, thing on the warthogs, and it's just so frustrating. You're sitting there firing away, firing away, firing away, and you, you gotta stop. You gotta stop and because of overheat. I'm just, just get rid of that, please. Three for three, please. Just get rid of that. Uh, it's just so frustrating. I don't know. I don't know. You would think. At some point in the future, in 2592, they would have developed metals strong enough to withstand a continuous fire for more than 30 seconds. <laughs> I'm just saying, I'm just saying, three for three. If you're listening, if you're watching, Unishek, if you watch this, hey, throw that out at them. Get rid of that dang overheat on the Warthogs. I, I don't like the Warthogs. I don't like the chain gun Warthogs. They're just not fun to use, um, largely because of that factor. Uh, at least in Halo 4, uh, you had this special uh, armor ability, or I, can't, I don't even know what it was called, tactical ability, whatever it was called. Uh, it was called Gunner, I believe it was called, and you could get on the back of a Warthog. And it's still overheat, uh, but it took a lot longer to get there. Um, but that was that. But anyways, this is kind of where the map is going to be right now, and... I'm probably going to do a little bit more forging later on. Just going to kind of take a quick look at what I have in mind here. I'm going to kind of throw in some trees and uh, do that type of stuff. And, and it's just going to kind of look nice like that. And so I'm going to do a throw some snow on there and so snow on so you guys can get a kind of a little of an idea of what I'm thinking um, as to this map. So, anyways, I hope you enjoyed the quick little forge session. Uh, maybe I'll see you guys online. Thanks again. This is Crazed. I'm out of here. Comment, like, and subscribe.